So I just wanted to show you a very quick and easy way to change labels on your map in ArcGIS Pro. And as an example, I've got U.S. states up here. You can see that it's covering U.S. County. So to be honest, the first thing I'm going to do is actually change the symbology here. Let's just make it a black outline. There we go. So now we can see everything that's below it. And let's zoom in to this layer. Oops, so it looks like it's already zoomed in. So I'm going to go zoom in closer, <laughs> doing it the old fashioned way. And let's grab it and drag it. All right, here we go. We got Alaska in there. We can barely see it, but that's fine for the moment. So here's our continental United States. Now what I want to do is just label it. And so we just right click on US states and click label. And we notice that we've got the states labeled, but it's the full name. And if we want to change the label to something else, the question is, how do you do that? Well, let's open up the attribute table really quickly. And in this particular exercise, we want to change the label from name to the abbreviation of the name, which is S-T-U-S-P-S. -S. So that's the abbreviation name that we're after. Just want to make this a little bit smaller. There we go. And so what I'm going to do now is just right click on US states again. Now we'll click labeling properties. And we have our basically what looks like a field calculator opening up again. And you'll notice here that the labeled expression is for name, which is this one. We're going to get rid of that. So we just highlight it, press delete. And now what we want is STUSPS. We'll double click on that. And then if you click apply, you'll notice now our label has changed. We've got the new label, which is now this column instead of this one. And if you want to change the symbology of it, um, you can change the appearance. And so now we can change the size of the font, the type of font, the color. We can make halo outlines. We can do whatever we want to it. So just to give you an example, let's say we change the text color from black, we can make it yellow, which is going to be hard to see on this map, but that's okay. Click apply and you can barely see it now because now the text is yellow, which is sort of a bonehead thing to do. So let's make it black again, or at least a different color that's darker. We can have an outline of it. Uh, again, we can do just about whatever we want. We can halo it and that's what we were asked to do in this particular exercise. So you can halo it to white if you want and we can apply our changes and you see what happens. So we can do anything we want with labels. You just sort of have to be a little bit clever with it. All right. If you have any questions, please let me know. And with that, until next time, bye-bye.